It is a great pleasure to greet you at this conference, which has taken many months of preparation. The Tom Lantos Institute, an independent human and minority rights organization based here in Budapest, has convened this conference to address the most pressing challenges and significant issues facing European Jewish communities today. The Tom Lantos Institute is remarkably positioned to take the lead on these issues. It was founded precisely to deal with such concerns. It takes forward the legacy of Tom Lantos, who, as many of you know, was a prominent human rights advocate and the only Holocaust survivor ever elected to serve in the US Congress. One of the key reasons for organizing this conference at this time is the alarming resurgence of anti-Semitism throughout Europe, including, and notably, Hungary. This is a worrying development for many Hungarians. Therefore, this conference brings together policymakers, academics, educators, and members of the civil society to address this issue and identify possible approaches to countering this phenomenon. The conference will also explore, from a number of perspectives, more hopeful and positive aspects of Jewish life in Europe. Identity, culture, effective interest protection, and interfaith dialogue are among the topics to be discussed. We began to outreach to participants not always sure of the willingness of others to take part in such a bold agenda. As we were crisscrossing between Jewish communities, civil society, academia, and policymakers, we found that many were ready to set aside distrust, ideological and political divisions, and come together to engage in discussion about the crucial issues addressed in this conference. We hope the confidence to be open to different views and engage in debates about solutions continues and prevails long after today. It was never the intention for this conference to be a standalone event. On the contrary, it feeds into our broader program on Jewish life and anti-Semitism with follow-up workshops developing policy recommendations or norms. I would like to thank in particular to Deputy Prime Minister Tibor Navracic for accepting our invitation to launch the conference. We are delighted to see here members of the Lantos family, in particular, Mrs. Annette Lantos, widow of the late Tom Lantos. We are also grateful to Minister Lapid for traveling here to address the conference. His father, Tommy Lapid, and Tom Lantos, both Hungarians and personal friends, survived the Holocaust and went on to be important public figures. While many helped in making this conference happen, I would particularly like to acknowledge the support and help of the Hungarian Ministry for Foreign Affairs, the Embassy of Israel in Budapest, Professor Andras Kovács from the Central European University, who has designed the expert part of the agenda. Last but not least, we wish to acknowledge the tremendous contribution of Mr. Phil Friedman, his energy and generosity helped us to bring this important project to fruition. While he could not attend in person, Hermann van Rompuy, President of the European Council, sends us this message of support for the conference. Please have a look at it. <laughs> 